I think that the Flynn application process is really rewarding even if it doesn't end up in receiving the Flynn scholarship. Um, it's definitely some challenging essays and the interview process is really challenging as well, but in doing those you kind of have the opportunity to look at all of the things you're involved in while in high school and narrow them down to understand your passions a little bit better. Um, I know it can be really hard while you're in high school to try to figure out a path for yourself and figure out um, what you're doing and why you're doing it and writing these sorts of essays and really challenging yourself to think critically about who you are and what you're doing, uh, this Flynn application process is a really great way to do that. Yeah, one piece of advice that I did not hear enough when I was going through the process would be that it's all going to turn out okay. I think there's a lot of pressure on you to figure out everything and feel like you have everything figured out, your next 10, 20 year plan, everything, every step along the way, and nobody does, and it never goes according to plan, and it's very sinuous, and there's a lot of wonderful turns along the way. So know that just by being interested, you are already on a great path to finding success in life and anything that you endeavor to do. So keep up the interest. I think uh, one of the key things to remember is like, don't answer the application as if you're trying to get whatever Flynn wants. Just answer the application honestly. Like if it asks you a question, just truly like, what do you think about it? Because like, you showing your unique experiences instead of trying to meet some benchmark that you think somebody else has created is going to be a lot power, more powerful. And um, we're gonna know, the, they're, they're gonna be able to see the honesty in your statement and feel the power of those arguments and those thoughts and those ideas and those perspectives. And so you should share them honestly, not, not, to, not to some rubric. There is no rubric. Um, every Flynn scholar is different and they bring a different thing to the table. So just showcase yourself. For me, I felt very intimidated by the other Flynn applicants when I was coming in just because I felt like I didn't have nearly as much experience in the real world as a lot of them did. Um, the thing that's important to remember is that the Flynn Scholarship doesn't look just for what you've done, but what you've done with the resources that you've had. So if you don't feel like you're qualified, look back and reflect on what opportunities you've had available. And if you've done really incredible things with just those, you'll be a great applicant.